If you have a local business and you're not successfully using the internet to market your products and services, this short video may well be the most important video you can watch right now. If you don't understand how to use the internet to grow your business, then your prospects won't find you, they won't hear about you and will buy from your competitors. You literally can't afford to ignore this any longer. Hi, my name's Jonathan Young and over the next few minutes I'm going to show you what you can do right now to get found online and engage and convert more prospects into customers. But first a few facts. Did you know almost three times as many 18 to 44 year olds use search engines to find local businesses than the print yellow pages? One in every three searches online are local searches and it's growing at 50% a year. 31% of UK internet users access the web from their mobiles and smartphones. And between the early and final stages of a purchase, 64% of consumers expect the business to be within 15 miles. In 2009, the internet contributed more to the UK economy than the construction, transportation and utilities industries. 98% of people choose a business on page one of the search engines. And Google is the new phone book. If your business is not on the first page of Google for phrases people use to find businesses like yours, then you're losing more new business to your competitors every single day. And this is where I can help. Here we are at good old Google and as you can see it's the Royal Wedding Day. You can see the image here and uh, there's ooh, you can even watch the Royal Wedding on YouTube. Uh, I just wanted to show you how powerful Google is for your business and really to hopefully get across that you really need to be here. Every local business really does because the power of this is is just amazing and the, the quality of results that our clients are. My clients are getting, and I've been doing this since 2006 with a lot of clients, uh, is just phenomenal. And to me, when I first saw Google, it kind of blew me away. I've always been in, in sales and marketing and one of the hardest things to do is to actually find people that want your stuff. And this to me just was mind-blowing because it's like someone walking down the street with a big placard above them saying look I'm after your stuff please tap me on the shoulder and uh, give me some it's really that powerful because people actually look for you and if you can be on the first page of Google um, very much like the biggest advert in the yellow pages this has taken over I mean this is the new yellow pages and it's as simple as that and you know it's not something that I'm saying it's just all the clients I talk to, the Yellow Pages ads are, or if they haven't already left, they're leaving because they're just not as effective as they used to be because people use this now. And I just wanted to kind of compare the two. So the first thing that you do, I mean, let's say um, you were, in the old days, you were looking for an MOT station to MOT your car. You'd get out the Yellow Pages, you'd flick through them to get to the car section, and then you'd look at the hundreds of insertions there for MOT stations and it didn't kind of give you much information it was just a little line or if you if you're a company that bought a big advert you'd have an ad in there but nothing really of any meat to to tell me as a client that I was good at what, or you were good at what you did so you know it kind of was limited in a way but it was the only way of doing it but now it's just amazing you just go to Google you type in MOT Ipswich and up pop a load of results and as you can see Google has about 1.2 million pages in its index that they regard for the keyword MOT Ipswich and so your job is to try and get to the to be within definitely within the first 10 of those 1.2 million results which takes a bit of effort and a bit of know-how and yes you can learn it and you can learn it in a few years but you know I'm here to actually do this for you now because time is of the essence. So anyway, MOT Ipswich. Google has changed so much since I first saw it. Now it's not just your um, the pages in Google's index. Here you've got obviously a page from Google's index, but here you've got adverts. You can see here it's ads. So all these people actually pay to be in this position. Um, and on the right hand side here we've got what's called Google Places or Google Maps and it's Google's way of helping small businesses and I'll, I'll get to that in a moment but as you can see just to give you a result of, of these are some of our clients as well obviously I'm going to show you that but MOT Ipswich um, if you're looking for an Ipswich MOT station 
This would be quite a good title. From £15 and Bias Local Services in Ipswich, and this is Land Speed. But you'll also notice that there's another result for Land Speed. So on the first page of Google, we've managed to get them two results plus a lovely image. So if you just click through, the other great thing about this is because the way we've optimized their website, you're actually going through to their home or the page all about MOTs. You're not going through to their home page. So we've managed to rank the page that's actually important for whoever's searching for this term. So that gives you one idea. So, you know, here we've got uh, Google Organics and we've also got uh, Google Places that are involved here and we've got two results for our client. Now, comparing this to Yellow Pages, you're going to get a lot more information because I can now click through and I've got everything I need here to tell me about this company. I can click around and really find out about what the company and what it's about. So it's important to have a really professional looking image and to say the right stuff on your website. But let's ha do another search as well. So here's another one that we've been working with earlier or recently. Um, let's do solicitors Ipswich. As you can see, I've got a kind of a bias to Ipswich. <laughs> I work with a lot of clients in this area. And as you can see, number two here are pretty solicitors. And we've been working with them a lot recently in the last three or four months. Um, and you can see they've got one result here, and I've also got a places page that's been linked to them as well. And if you click through to their places page, and this is what we, this is the other part of what we do. We actually create places page for small businesses uh, because they're really important now. Uh, so you've got a load of information here. You can click through to the website. You've got contact details. So it's important. It's a, an important uh, thing to have in your arsenal when you're marketing for Google. Um, but let's just do another term. Let's do probate solicitors. So, so again, we're looking for something where we're so actually it's not a great word, but uh, someone has died. We need a solicitor to actually sort out the will and everything. So we'd be looking for probate solicitors. And if we were in Ipswich, that's probably the geo modifier we'd use. So we'll search for that. And as you can see, you see now this is where it becomes really important on Google Places because Google, there's 235,000 results for probate solicitors Ipswich and the first one they give is a Google Places page and it's pretty solicitors. And underneath that you'll also notice that we've got another solicit we've got another ranking here which is their website ranking and again it takes them absolutely through to the page that's pertinent to their search wills and probates listers. It doesn't get more targeted to that. So we're actually giving the client exactly or the person that's searching exactly what they're looking for. So there's a very good chance that this will turn into a into a client because um, first of all Google are saying hey we're, we're saying Pretties is the one because I mean it doesn't get any more obvious than this that they're ranking Pretties very well for for this search term. Um, so again if you're comparing it to to yellow pages you'd have to do a big you'd have to do a search again and you wouldn't be able to go down to this kind of granular level of probate solicitors you'd actually just get a, a big list of solicitors and a load of adverts this gives you just so much more and as you can see here Google knows where I am a location so another thing that's really important you can't cart around the yellow pages with you and you certainly can't cart around every single yellow pages for every region but if I wanted to look for probate solicitors and this is really important for mobile searches because people don't um, want to type too much in on their mobiles or, or obviously their tablets the first thing that comes up in most smartphones and tablets now GPS is enabled Google uses that to actually work out their location so you could just put probate solicitors in and because Google this is, this is on your mobile but it's also on desktop so I'll show you but it, because Google knows I'm in Ipswich um, it will actually show me probate solicitors. It will give me all the results which are the main national results but it's also going to give me the local results and the only one is showing is, is pretties. So if you're in Ipswich this is the one you're going to kind of click. So again Google Places is massively important but I just wanted to show you something else which I think is something we've been working on for a while now and it just is, is phenomenal for our clients. Here's a another client I've been working with Chris from Cooker Clean since 2006 and so there's another thing um, you know the the techniques we use are not things that are fly by night you know we're not these black hat SEO things that 
trick the search engines and correct doorway pages and spam the search engines just to get you some quick results. These are things that have lasted for a long time. Uh, and as you can see here, Cooker Cleaner, our client, they've got the number one position. They've got the Google Places page. Again, we're using, we're getting a lot of the um, main above the screen, above the fold is what they call it. So the screen that you can actually see right now is is really really important real estate and if you can own a lot of it and knock all your competitors further off where people have to then scroll that's good so as you can see here we've got cooker clean number one we've got their places page number two we've got another feeder site which is feeding into his site uh, that we've set up for him so you know you can have lots of results all pointing back to your page um, and further down as you can see we've got two videos in here as well and again these are uh, uh, video sites that are just short videos, uh, infomercials almost. Think about your business if it could have infomercials running 24 hours a day um, and it can rank on the first page of Google, what that would do for your business. So I'll just show you one of these. So we click through and here's a little infomercial and it's going to have lots of stuff on it that are just going to get you back to Chris's site. And as you can see in it, you've got some great pictures you've got some branding so people know where to go but beneath here you can see that we've actually got a link through to cooker clean so I'll just turn that off now so you can actually hear me um, and if I click that it actually takes them straight through to the site so again it's another amazing thing you can use um, within Google to actually get on the first page so we kind of dominate or Chris dominates Google's first page this is another part of um, Cooker Clean, it's another site there over in Felixstowe. So again, it's all part of the same thing. Uh, so all the competitors have been pushed off onto page two, and you kind of he kind of owns Oven Cleaning Ipswich. But you know that's not just the word we want. We want Suffolk as well. So here he is, Oven Cleaning Suffolk. It's Chris again. Um, let's try Woodbridge because he actually does Oven Cleaning in Woodbridge. Again, you've got Cooker Clean as number one. You've got Cooker Clean here. You've got Cooker Clean from Felix to Oven Cleaning, which is part of the same thing. Um, so it gives you an idea of the power of, of what you can do. And you don't just have to have one result on the first page of Google. You can actually own the first page of Google. It's as simple as that. But, you know, it's all well and good doing it for small businesses. But the other things that we've managed to do is for really, I mean, if you're a web designer in Suffolk, you know, one of the key words that you're going to want is web design Suffolk and so this is my partner this is his web design company and it's loophole so again we work with people that are within the industry and we can still rank them uh, and if I do web design Ipswich because this is a big part of his business you can see loophole are number one as well so that gives you an idea that there's there's lots there's lots here, but Google is where it's all happening for you. And and to to get a result on the first page of Google is, is difficult enough, but to get lots of results is where I can kind of help. And it creates a lot of traffic to your site, which then converts, hopefully converts, as long as the copy on your website is good enough, into prospects for you, very qualified prospects, which are very simple then to turn into customers. And this thing works 24 hours a day and people find you. It blows the yellow pages out of the water which is why people don't use it anymore. This is why the yellow pages has shrunk in size, it's shrunk in thickness. Um, you know you're getting called if you do use the yellow pages your results have not been as good as they were. We've got clients that ask me for my for their results of how many people have been visiting their website from yellow pages and it's just dwindling every year. So if you'd like to talk more about this and if you'd like me to be able to help your business get on the front page of Google for words and phrases that people use to look for your business and they're looking right now and to be able to beat your competitors to the punch please give me a call I'm sure somewhere on this page there'll be a contact details or a link uh, get in touch and uh, I'll look forward to speaking to you very shortly